creating a wireless security profile on the WC7600. Hi everybody, today we're going to demonstrate how easy it is to create a wireless security profile on the Netgear ProSafe WC7600 Premium Wireless Controller. In our access point setup and discovery video, we discovered two WM370 APs and paired them with our WC7600. The next step is to create a wireless security profile on the WC7600 so that our users have a secure wireless network to log on to. By default, the WC7600 provides an open wireless network on both the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz bands. For security purposes, it is extremely important that you modify these default wireless profiles so that they use proper authentication and encryption. So the first step is to log in to the web management interface of the WC7600 and open up a new browser window and type in the IP address of our wireless controller. Log in. Once we're logged in, click on the configuration tab and the profile sub menu item. As you can see there's a basic and advanced section. Uh, the advanced section allows you to do a lot of really neat things such as group together wireless security profiles and then subsequently apply them to different groups of APs. Uh, however in today's video we're just going to go ahead and cover the basics. Getting back to our demo, you can see that there's a tab for the 2.4 GHz band as well as a tab for the 5 GHz band. Within each band, you can create multiple wireless security profiles. For this demo, since the WN370 APs are 2.4 GHz only, I'm going to configure the wireless profile on the 2.4 GHz band. What we're going to do next is to customize the default profile so that it is secure. If we want to create additional profiles we can do so by clicking on the plus button over here. So first we're going to give our wireless network a name and now give it an SSID. And yes we want to broadcast that SSID. For network authentication we're going to change it to something a lot more secure. I'm going to go use WPA2 PSK and for data encryption we're going to use a yes and finally we're going to give it a nice and secure passphrase and click apply and that's it in less than a minute we have configured a secure SSID for our wireless users to log on to Keep in mind, this is the most basic of wireless deployments supported by the WC7600. There are many more flexible deployment options available where you can granularly tailor the wireless network according to your needs. Thanks for watching.